Mr. Dyer, you have a complaint that's sort of interesting. There's only one part of it that I'm interested in. The other part of your complaint is that you and the defendant enter into sort of an agreement that you're a sort of amateur writer of music, lyrics and melody. The defendant plays the guitar. You have another career, so does he. And you agreed with him to rent a studio so that he could create music music that you had written lyrics to and melody to, and he would put that all together from all the different parts and make music. You rented the studio, you paid for the studio, you claimed that he didn't produce anything during that period of time. You finally threw him out of the studio and took it over yourself. Yes, ma'am. And lived in it. No, ma'am, I lived in my van. Okay, but you took over. But I... Uh, after you, after you I took, took it, it over, over, I did use... Yes, Your Honor. That's not That's true, just, Your Honor. Just a second. Mm -hmm. That's all I'm saying. After you took over the lease from him, because he did, hadn't produced anything, then you lived in it, whether you lived in it before or after, is not relevant, because I'm not even considering the studio. Do you understand? Yes. The only part of your complaint that I am going to consider is whether or not, if you did the music and lyrics and the defendant titled that music in his name only, it would seem to me that that would be grossly unfair. You would agree with that, Mr. Lick? That I copyrighted it? Uh, no. The... You would agree that if you in any way titled the music, which he provided the melody and yeah. lyrics to, you provided the musical background and the guitar, if you titled that in only your name, that would be unfair. Absolutely. Did you? I did not. Did you title it in both your names? I did. May I see proof of that? Yes. Authorship is right there. Well, why didn't you copyright it in both your names? Well, I was urged to do the copyright. At first, I did not want to do Just it. Just a second. I don't care whether you wanted to do it, mm -hmm. whether somebody forced you to do it. This gives him certain attribution, mm -hmm. but it lists you as the copyright claimant. And I'm asking you why. Well, he left it up to me to copyright. I don't have any expertise in the copyrights. I didn't understand what I was copywriting. Initially, we decided everything should go down 50-50, and I still honor that agreement. What, no, I'm just what... asking you. Yeah. That's the only thing that I'm interested in. Yeah. That it would seem to me to be fair that was your original agreement, that you were going to collaborate and make music. Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, these, these songs, the title of work, God Over All EP, is that yes, it? Okay. Was there a cost, Mr. Lick, to copyright this? There was. And how much? It was roughly $55. Okay. And you have no objection if Mr. Dyer amends the copyright to include his name, copyright oh, claimant absolutely. with both names. Yes, Your Honor. I would have no objection to that. You would have no objection to that? Absolutely. Okay. So you would have no objection in signing a document today saying that Raymond Dyer has my permission and authority to add his name as copyright claimant along with mine on God Overall. I would be happy with that, Your Honor. You have a problem with that? Your Honor, um... Just a second. Yes, that's I... why you're here. Yes, if I understand you... that, Your Honor. That's why you're here. You're that's not here I... for money because money you're not getting. Yes, ma'am. You're here because you say it was unfair of Mr. Lick, who did list you, and you've seen the copyright papers. Yes. So you see that you were listed as author along with Mr. Lick. He's prepared to allow you to assume the responsibility of amending the copyright to make you co-copyright claimant. Your Honor, I've tried to get Dave to do this for 10 months. Just a minute, I just did it. Yes, ma'am. Now, so what's your complaint? He's going to sign a document allowing you to do it. He will sign whatever papers that they send to him to sign. If you have them, he'll sign them now. Do you have them? Can he sign them like this, Your Honor? Sure, let me see. I wrote the Shh, melodies and the listen, lyrics. Listen to me. Excuse me? I don't care. Well, I, he's got to sign it the right way. He's the composer of it. I'm the lyric writer. I want him to sign that I wrote the lyrics and the melodies. He wrote the guitar. I've always wanted him to do that for 10 months. He won't do it. If he'll do it with you, I appreciate that, but man. Just a second. I'm reading your complaint. Oh, what you're asking for is you're asking him to sign over the copyright to you yes, in your complaint. Your Honor. Well, yes, that's you're not going to get. He's prepared. Wanna... Listen to me. This is what he's Go prepared ahead. to do. He is prepared, and I am prepared to have someone draft that document that you can be listed. You assume the responsibility of the work to do it as the copyright co claimant on the certificate of registration. So you're already listed as an author. Yes, Your Honor. Okay?